this real fast because my battery on my phone is dying. But this is my custom Lego DeLorean I just finished today. Built completely from scratch, out of spare parts. It took about 15 to 20 hours. No instructions, it just took forever. Um, but I think it came out really, really nicely. I think it looks much better than the actual Lego DeLorean that they released. The hardest thing about building this car was actually the tires, because normally on a LEGO vehicle the tires are kind of over here sticking on the sides, but I wanted to get the tires under the car, so it was more like a real car. And that actually was the most difficult aspect of building this thing. My kid's asleep in the other room, which is why I'm kind of whispering. But yeah, it came out great. Big fan. The Eagle doors came out really nicely. Um, very difficult to actually build those things and you know decorated the inside of the car with some stickers you can't really see it though because the glare i think the only thing that's actually kind of a problem with this car when i built it was i spent hours trying to figure out a way to attach this windshield properly and i ended up just settling with like gravity so it's just it's nothing's actually holding it in place it's just held in place by gravity but other than that i feel like it came out really nicely i'm really a huge fan of it i don't know where i got these back pieces um these pieces over here um, and that's what it looks like from behind. And yeah, I think it came out really well. I'm definitely not going to take this thing apart ever, so it's going to go into my permanent collection. And yeah, it's one of my more favorite pieces. I sent the photos to my friends, and I was like, what is this? And they are like, it's a DeLorean from Back to the Future. And so I was like, cool, it looks like what it's supposed to look like. That's usually how I test things. I just send photos and go like, what is this? And then my friends will tell me what they think it is. So I'm like, yeah. It came out, like, pretty nice. I'm definitely surprised at how long it took to build, but, yeah, I just think it came out fantastic. So, yeah, I highly recommend whenever you don't want to pay a ridiculous amount of money for a Lego set to just try to build it from scratch and just stick with it. And I think if you do stick with it, you'll end up with something that you're much more pleased with than if you just bought the set and built it. So, yeah.